TV. We're currently in Ekiti State University where there has been recent events of killings of um, young students who are either 400 level students or, a gra or graduates. And um, we've been trying to speak to the students who have been scared to, to voice out their opinion. But despite all odds, we had some few people who gave us their time to, to, to listen to their cries and their pleas to the government and those in charge. Back then, there had been lots of incidents like this. But it is not happening again. And now it's resuscitating. To avoid the past occurrences to happen again, I think it is very, very salient that you call on the attention of not only the state government, but the federal government to beef up the security of this institution. Because, like this morning now, police came to the hostel that is beside my home. They arrest both male and female. You mean the, the, the police officers came around and arrested both the yes. students and the occupants of the hostel? Yes. Mount Carmel hostel. Mount Carmel hostel. Mount Carmel hostel. Where? At the back of my hostel. That hostel is at the back of my hostel. They arrest some innocent students, both male and female. So what do you think about the recent events happening around the school, the uh, killings? Well, it's been crazy, actually. It's been crazy. You know, throughout the school environment, it has been people being scared of one thing or the other. But actually, the rumor is that, I'm not sure, the rumor is that um, it's all about this cultist of a thing, which right. nobody is sure. Nobody is safe at this moment because this this thing actually made most students not to be around. Hmm. In fact, some of my mates they are supposed to complete their project, but due to the fear, the the terrification, they have to just leave untimely. They get hmm. so, but I don't just know what to say. You know, it's been crazy. Well, for me, the government should rise up, especially after all the killings right now. They should rise up and put a stop to it. It's in their capability, something they can do. They should put a stop to it. Find a, a build up a group or a community that comes that come against it. Like right now, after this killings, the police officers that are putting on the road is not enough. It's not enough. They should build up a community a group that will that will stay with this. That will, their main focus is coming against this kind of thing. We have time, we have the purpose to, to cancel this kind of thing. That's what I feel on it, in my opinion. And I believe that uh, courtism is, is, uh, should be eradicated, should have been ed eradicated on, 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 on this campus. We are in a civilized community. We are in a civilized society. How can we permit uh, such uh, atrocity to, to go on? In, in our in, on our campus, and I, I, I blame it on non non existence of uh, uh, what do they call it student hotels hostels within the campus. If students are within the campus, there will be control. There will be control. They will be. They, 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 they will be under some kind of control so that uh, what Yoruba will call Odua Kamwama. But when everybody lives where he, he can find a shelter, I, I think is is not is not is not good. It's not good. That is why it is not about courtesy alone. It's about uh, young girls carrying babies all about on campus.